Here's how to share a file with a shared link in Google Drive. This example is done from a Google Apps account. The sharing settings are similar in a personal Google Drive account. So from the Files view, you can hover over and right-click on any given file. Select Get Link. That'll show you the default settings. If those work for you, for example, anyone with the link can edit the file, works for me, then you can hit Command C or Control C on a Windows PC, copy the link, and you can paste it anywhere. Or if you want to further customize who can um, view or edit the file, you can go to Sharing Settings right here. This is where Google Drive really isn't that intuitive or easy. You have to learn the system. So under here, you can select either anyone within your company if you have Google Apps or anyone with the link. And then from there, you can also select more to have more customization settings. So we have anyone with the link set for this one already. But then if it's a document or something we want other people to be able to edit without logging into their Google account first, then we can change this so that the public can edit. The biggest difference between this setting and the one above it, public on the web, is searchability. This one is a direct link only accessible by someone who has that custom URL. Public on the web allows that URL to be and the document to be searchable. The biggest advantages to this one is that you don't have to be logged into your Google account. So it's great for someone who doesn't use Google, isn't as tech savvy, perhaps has corporate firewalls at work. Um, this one is fantastic if you have a Google Apps account for sharing things only within your company, but making sure that no one else outside the organization has access. Most of the time, we use anyone with the link when sharing files, just because that makes sure that anyone that needs access to it can have it. It's just the easiest one. However, we always use can view when sharing with clients, vendors, anyone who doesn't need to edit the file for business use. So you can hit save. That saves the setting for that file permanently until it's otherwise changed, and then you can copy it from there. You can paste the link into any window. For example, here's a new browser window. Pasted the link where I'm not logged into any Google account, and the file comes right up. Hope that helps.